Okay, here we are. I got my pencil, I got the pad. We're gonna do a drawing for Heather, Scooter Girl. I remember you, your hair for a while. We were showing you the ins and outs of stop motion animation. You got to help us out in the studio. So I'm gonna do a special dinosaur for you. Actually, what should I do? Um, you know, something cute, um, something scootery. <laughs> you know, uh, you know what? I'm gonna try a, uh, maybe a cute stegosaurus, and uh, I, I think that'll work out good. If not, there's a lot more. Give it a shot. Any any sounds that you hear is the chair, not me. Okay. I always start with uh, with a circle, and we'll give it a cute head because babies have slightly larger heads. So we'll just do something like this. It has a little beak, and I'm just laying it in just the shapes really lightly some of these lines I might take out with an eraser I'm going to try to avoid the eraser if I can so I'm getting the, the basic feel here make it cute and gentle like Heather And do a little bit of darkening, get some tone going on here. I'm happy with pretty much what's going on. Now, here we got the all-important spikes. Now, what's interesting is I'm a left-handed, and you can see that I'm, I'm, I'm smearing my drawing as I go along. Sometimes that works for me because it gives a little intermediate shade, which is really funny. I figured that one out. It's an excuse, but... And I'm doing these little scales since he's adolescents, they're not huge. And it's really funny, they're funny little shapes. And I'll throw a little detail on there. It's my little squiggly line detail. I developed it over many years. My squiggly line detail. This plate doesn't belong here because this is where the neck does. But you don't know that because we're not paleontologists. Because it doesn't matter. I take a lot of license with my dinosaurs. The dinosaurs smile, we don't know. Some of the uh, carnivores were smiling when they were eating you, I would imagine. Crocodiles or, and alligators are always smiling. I'm not, I, don't put, I don't draw every scale. I'm just drawing and I'm going back in and darkening and just throwing a little, little darkness and dragging my hand, my left hand, over, you know. It, which is sort of softening and tying things together. So I'm going back and throwing a couple more darks in. Defining stuff. I put a little bush here. A little primordial bush. A little shrubbery, as they say. I think it's time. And I will... I think I left some room. I might have put the shrubbery a little too close. But here we go. It's a Charlie... Kyoto... <laughs> and it was finished in 2013. This is it. Q Stegosaurus for Heather the Scooter Girl. And there's a lot more where that came from.